guys, here we are. The 098 TJ. Last video, we put a new helical limited slip in the front there. And then went out for the Halloween Jeep ride. Five minutes into the ride. This happened. I don't know if you can see that. There it is. This happened right here. Bolts broke off in the rear drive shaft yoke. So we didn't get to do much riding. So here we are ready to fix it. New yoke. Alright, here we are back at the old uh, TJ here. Fixing the drive shaft. I was showing you earlier. And the battery went dead on the camera. So, missed that repair. So we made our repair. Here we have it. You joint and yoke. This yoke is the U bolt style. I don't know if you can see that. Rather than the strap style, they say the U bolt style is stronger. So that's, that's an upgrade. I guess it's a pretty good upgrade. But the problem is, while we were under here, working on that, we discovered a big problem. So, here's the big problem. I don't know if you can see that. Here it is. That frame bracket, I don't know if you can tell, it's tore loose from the frame. It's supposed to be all nice up there. Both sides. That bracket is the top link control arm bracket. For the back axle. So with both brackets tore loose from the frame it allowed the rear end to rotate which probably caused that U joint to break so that's where we're at gotta get that fixed so there we are with the Jeep there the TJ need new brackets you can order new brackets on Amazon I think 53 bucks a piece weld them up on there which we can do we have a welder torch grinder but that's a job for a different day Jeep's out of commission though till we get that done it's a bummer